I'm sitting in a large conference room on the campus of a Fortune 50 company. Flanked by my side is my executive team. On the other side of the table is the executive team of the client. We're talking about their Olympic strategy for their advertising and marketing. And I have a great idea. And I don't say anything. I feel scared. I feel like they're going to think I'm stupid. I think I'm going to look foolish. So I just sit still and take notes and sit on this great idea. Luckily for me, about two weeks later, my manager says, hey, do you want to go to a leadership training course on emotional intelligence? I'm like, yeah, that sounds good. So I show up, and one of the modules is about storytelling and the art of storytelling. And I fall in love because I realize that I can tell my story and use my voice. I don't have to look good. I don't have to be an expert or anything. I don't have to be smart. I just get to be me. Fast forward two months later, I am in the same conference room with the same executive team, and I am totally lit up by sharing my strategic story about how they should go to the Olympic Games and compare their product to winning a gold medal. The CEO of the company was so excited and enthralled by the story, he almost stood up and gave me a standing ovation.